Texas. It's starting to look a lot like exploring a lot of coffee shops to get work done. Um, taking trips to juice bars and slowly getting to know my city for what it really is. My name is Amarchi and I'll be taking you on a tour on what a typical week looks in my life. So if you're new here, stay posted. A popular saying in Austin is keep Austin weird and the people definitely want it that way. We want we are the people and we we like it weird. It's nicely weird, I must say. But there's something about Austin and there's something it's given. It gives off youthful vibe. It's starting to help me embrace being independent. But most of all, Austin, it's about, Austin is about people. You know, it helps you understand that you need people and you have to be dependent on a support system to survive. Now, a typical Sunday in my life looks like having a good brunch with friends and you know it's a time to bond on a good Sunday not every Sunday and this was me after brunch my friends had gone home um, I had a meeting that I had to prepare for um, the day before I had a good nice photo shoots with um, a client and I have to prepare for a meeting to go through those photos so I'm just getting ready and I had to stop by a coffee shop to prepare for this meeting and I had the best oat milk latte shout out to Intelligentsia coffee shop for doing their thing because this coffee was banging I must say this is not a sponsored video, but yeah, feel free to check out Intelligentsia. I think, I believe they're New Oasis Street in Austin, Texas. They also have other branches in Chicago. Intelligentsia, if you're seeing this video, your girl loves coffee and... Another interesting part of my week was the photo shoot I had on um, Saturday. It was really interesting. I had to explore this cute pink coffee shop. Like I said, my life is really looking like coffee. So yeah. Then on Wednesday, I had a brunch date with a friend and I was exploring Korean barbecue. Fun fact about me is I'm a huge fan of Asian cuisine you're not gonna find me much at american cuisine if i have to choose because of you know why if you're into food you know that there's nothing much about american cuisine and the real deal is asian cuisine argue with your credit card <laughs> okay so i arrived early so i'm still waiting for my friend to come and yeah, I, I, I didn't know the spot. It was a friend that told me about it because she realized that I really like Asian cuisine and I would rate, well, let's get right in and we will find out all we need to know. I definitely did love the aesthetics of this place. Um, the rustic vibe was really good. I like the fact that he had sake so I could also eat and get work done. Um, there's also a coffee shop nearby. In fact, I think they're interesting spots like around this complex that makes it really attractive for me. And let's get into the menu. They had a very good balanced menu. Options for like if you're, you know, if you like eating healthy and whatnot, it's a good option for you. A lot more variety if you're vegan. Um, so like, I would say like... It's a really good place to try if you're ever in Austin, Texas. It's located in the North Burnett area. And they also had a good variety of drinks. I was really interested in their peach basil lemonade. I definitely did love the peach basil lemonade. Did I get to try it? No. They also had iced tea. 
um so now if you know me you know i suck at looking at the menu sometimes menus get really overwhelming for me so my friend here had to help me out and she told me about the famous kimchi fries i don't know if i'm saying it well but help me if i'm not saying it correctly so the original kimchi fries from chilantro in austin contains a mount of crispy fries topped with caramelized kimchi two kinds of cheese cilantro onions magic sauce sriracha and a couple of other interesting stuff i'll put the menu right here um, for you to know the details of this recipe and i think it's really really good Welcome to my food vlog. I have finished eating. I think I really like my food a lot. Um, I didn't go for rice because as a Nigerian, we're always eating rice. Anywhere we see rice, we're like, mm, you know? And I love my top. I love my top. Uh, yeah, my friend just left. I didn't have time to review this as I was eating. And this is how your my food came in this box. I don't think it's aesthetically safe that my food is in this box, but oh well. I think I'll give this thing a 6 over 10. A 6 over 10 is good. Um, 6 over 10 for my food. It's not bad, but it's like easy, quick food. If you like fries and like all those greasy stuff, you would definitely enjoy this. Um, but for the ambience, I think I'll give this place an 8. Just because it's a good, nice brunch ambience, and I like the location. It's not in like a rowdy, like very loud area. It's in a very, very, very kind of quiet area in Austin. And there are a lot of other places, spots like you know, by it. And yeah, I hope you can hear what I'm saying, Sha. <laughs> but yeah, I had a good time with my friend. Um, and here's to be more intentional and uh, creating videos here's to more brunch um, on a budget basically my meal cost me like ten dollars and yeah so basically nine dollars eighty something cents after tax it's probably like ten dollars but yeah cheers to more brunch i'm excited um i guess when next i come i'll try out like other things like the bowl and yeah i'm really excited so i think a lot of people come here like in the in the minutes i've been here it's been there's been a good number of traffic but i like it was not so much but um yeah i love this place it's so aesthetically pleasing for me i'm calming like fun it's really nice like i said ambience is an eight over ten for a fun spot and it takes a lot for my food because of the food I had. Um, yeah, it wasn't too crazy and it wasn't bad. It was really just good. So I hope six of ten is what people are rating it. Up. And the reason why I'm giving it a six of ten is because I was distracted throughout my lunch. Distracted in a good way because I was having a good conversation with my friend and we're just laughing. <laughs> we're laughing. She claims I'm funny, but. Please let me know in the comment section if you really think I'm funny. Anyway, but yeah. And um, it's a wrap for today. Just 
taking oh, like okay. B-rolls. Thank you. You know, you're fine. Oh, <laughs>